Welcome to this recorded demonstration of SciSense, where we will introduce to you how SciSense makes it easy to instantly reveal business insights from complex data using our complete end-to-end -end BI platform. By reviewing this recording, you will be able to understand how SciSense enables business users to make data-driven decisions faster, the ease of creating dashboards from your data, and how to create your data model using SciSense. The demonstration begins at the dashboard module in the role of a business user. Dashboards are accessed on the web and leverage common authentication systems such as Active Directory and Single Sign-On to ensure each user only has access to data they have been assigned rights to. Upon scanning the dashboard, it becomes quickly evident that there was a strong decrease in month-over-month -month revenue, even though our unit's growth is healthy at 9%. A user typically will want to ask questions of the data to understand not just what is happening, but why. SciSense excels in empowering business users to ask questions of the full data set, not just portions or extracts of them. All dashboards in SciSense are fully interactive. Some of the more popular features are the ability to filter and refine data based on a selected value or criteria across the entire dashboard. This allows users to utilize the full scope of data to answer questions and to focus on exploring relationships between the data sets. Viewers can also drill into any visualization. This feature is helpful for some viewers who prefer information presented in different formats. In this example, some viewers may prefer information presented in monthly, weekly, or daily time intervals and can define these preferences with one click, all without having to build new data extracts. Additionally, this feature allows users to explore the relationships between tables and data sources at any granularity without pre-definition. For example, viewers can ask what-if questions, such as how many sales were generated at different discount schedules. Continuing in our investigation, one can see that entry and wireless products continue to sell well, but other products do not. Let's focus more on the sales of all our products to investigate why. Within the Sales Revenue Dashboard, we see various visualization options that display insights in different graphical formats. In this example, a regression analysis helps forecast future sales. SciSense Narratives utilizes natural language generation to interpret insights from the visualizations into everyday language. This enables each user to extract the full value of information in the dashboard, regardless of their data literacy skill set, and ensure each user is interpreting the information similarly. SciSense Narratives analyzed a very important insight that may have been overlooked in the visualization. Wireless security has a perfect negative correlation with WAN acceleration models. As we sell more wireless models, WAN acceleration decreases. Why is that? Let's focus more of our analysis to understand why. Returning to the main dashboard, it becomes evident that marketing spin is down significantly, showing a strong correlation between our marketing spin and sales per week is detected. Remember that outlier of negative correlation between wireless security and WAN acceleration models that Sison's narratives shared? The amount of marketing spend per product and the relationship to sales becomes easy to understand when we drill into our data. WAN acceleration products receive the most marketing spend, yet brings in the least amount of sales. The inverse is true for wireless security. The pivot table also corroborates our findings. Wireless security sells 36 more units per marketing dollar spend. Keep a pulse on changes in our business in the marketing budget. Click on any KPI and add an alert. Set thresholds of your choosing or utilize machine learning to track anomalies in the data. You will be kept abreast of these changes via email, mobile app, or Slack, for example. Pulse alerts can also be set across different dashboards and across different areas of your business. Now, let's take a step back and show how easy it is to create elements from this dashboard. An aspect of strong user adoption of dashboards can be attributed to business users experiencing instant gratification when asking questions and receiving insights from the data. The quicker that process becomes, the more insights are gathered and the more data savvy your company becomes. During the presentation of the designer role within SciSense, we will illustrate how visualizations, when combined with data and business logic, can broaden the business user audience of who can easily explore your data landscape and receive insights quickly. A designer is granted permission to specific or multiple data sets from which beautiful dashboards and reports can be created. From this blank state, 
Let's start by gaining a high-level understanding of how our business is performing across our products by creating our first KPI. One can see different fields from different data sets, in this case, SQL, Google Sheets, and CSV, in one row as if it was a single data set, which it is. In our high-performance analytical database we call the Elasticube, we can also query and receive data directly from analytical databases. Let's start by computing gross sales. Looking in the dataset, however, we don't have that field available. Not a problem. It can be created on the fly without assistance from IT or a technical analyst. It's as simple as doing it in Excel. Menu-driven formulas allow designers to easily create business logic, such as gross sales, from any dataset combination within the Elasticube on the fly. This allows you to leverage your business user's existing skill sets. Formulas can be saved and reused throughout the entire dashboard, so they are applied consistently. And with just a few clicks, your first KPI is created. To see the gross sales broken out by product, leverage the formula created and easily select different visualizations to choose from. Here are just a few examples available as a designer. Sysen centralizes your data in our proprietary analytical database without the maintenance of managing views, extracts, or aggregations. Designers and viewers are afforded the full flexibility to work with all your data on the fly, making it easier for designers and viewers to use the full perspective of your entire data set to draw more informed conclusions. Dashboard filters allow users to display information needed to help users get the insight they need intuitively and without having to create three different dashboards or visualizations to anticipate what they may want to see. It's also easy for users to consume higher granularity details that they can then filter and explore further. Dashboard creation and consumption is all done in HTML5, allowing you to move and dynamically change the visualizations so they look great on any device. We also have a native mobile app that can be white-labeled. Sysense can be fully white-labeled and easily embedded into your application, allowing each user and tenant to enjoy insights in a customized, scalable, and secure environment. After successfully replicating a few widgets from the original sales dashboard we just demonstrated, it can be easily distributed or embedded into any number of named viewers or within an application. Insights to each user or tenant is based on your data security and governance setup providing greater confidence that sensitive information remains with people it is supposed to. Now that we have successfully recreated widgets from the sales dashboard we viewed at the beginning of the demo, let's now shift our focus to the data module within Sysense to show how easy it is to build a data model within our central data hub platform. The Elasticube is Sysense's high-performance analytical database designed to support large data sets across various analytical requirements. It provides a logical approach to combine data sources with the equivalent of dozens of separate views in a single Elasticube. This offers greater agility to answer any business question quickly and with significantly less data management. We can also create live data models in Sysense. This allows you to establish multi-table relationships and query data directly in an analytical database while leveraging the same web-based data model features. We start the process by creating an Elasticube, which we will bring various types of data into. Here you see that Sysense connects to a host of relational databases, flat files, and web applications. We also have options to use REST APIs so you can rapidly and securely connect to other datasets easily. In this example, we are going to work with data from an SQL server, Google Sheets, and a CSV file. After connecting to the database, the first step is to identify source tables to perform analysis on. In this case, order line, orders, and sales employees. When adding data, relationships previously defined in SQL will automatically pull into the Elasticube Manager, saving time and effort. The visually intuitive data mashup layer helps navigate data by removing guesswork. Each table is represented as a node or circle, where the size and color reflect the data type and data size of the table. There are a variety of options to gather metadata about the table. For example, the right side of the orders table provides a visual cue that it has a relationship with sales amp table. When clicking on the relationship icon, a navigation panel shows the field linking the two tables where further actions can be conducted. Joining tables between dbo.orderline and dbo.orders is a simple drag-and-drop function. 
With one click, create a relationship between all the fields so when a user asks a question of the data, they can leverage the entirety of the data set. Let's continue to expand the data model by adding data from CSV and Google Sheets into the ElastiCube. When linked between SQL Server, our users will be able to derive insights across multiple dimensions. Modeling the data is easy. Drag and drop one table from one data set to another. Link them with the common field, in this case, the budget key. Stay within the navigation panel to continue joining data sets. Add metadata, rename table titles, or even add comments via a data dictionary to provide more context to your data model that makes dashboard creation easier. Sysense imports, transforms, and loads tables into a high-performance analytical database. It does not blend the tables into view or extract, allowing you to scale across thousands of tables and dozens of data sources. Data discovery is further enhanced with the ability to sample, preview, and filter data from tables or custom fields. This allows you to ensure the right data is at the ready for visualization, whether it came from a custom SQL statement or table in a database. Multi-layer data governance ensures only certain data in ElastiCubes are dynamically shared based on your security settings. At Sysense, we want you to analyze data with complete agility. In this demo, we covered the basics of data mashup, valuable data analysis, delivering impact with Pulse, data governance security, and embedding options as part of our tightly integrated BI platform. To experience real insights from your own data for yourself, download a free trial of Sysense today at www.sysense.com slash get slash free dash trial.